It's revolving around the legless one that you might have seen in the park. Too. So if you've noticed that he's moved out of the room, just look around the building for him with your cameras. If you find him, just stare at him a few seconds and he should move back to the previous room he was in. We're not entirely sure why this works. Uh, the engineers have speculated that it has something to do with the audio of the active cameras messing with the signals or something. It just kind of works. So, definitely make sure to keep note of that. Oh, how have the other two been, by the way? If you're smart, you'll have kept quiet while Poe's around, and you would have shut the door on Lala, the uh, yellow one on the stage with that head. All right, well, that's all I've got tonight. Things look like they're going to be changing up tomorrow, though, so I'll be sure to keep you updated. Have a safe night.
morning. Wait, no, midnight. Uh, so how have you been? Things must be going pretty well if you're still around. Uh, not that you could die, but you probably should have quit by now. Wait, no, 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 don't tell management I said that. Uh, anyway, we got that green one up and working. Uh, Dipsy, on stage. The one that actually has a head. Well, he'll be moving now. Hopefully not at this very moment, but sometime later tonight. Uh, regarding this one, you'll definitely need to keep him out of your room. Apparently, he has some kind of signal malfunction that damages any hardware he goes near. Seeing as how the power box is in your office, that could be very lethal. However, we noticed that another bug he has is a lack of night vision. So if you see him moving, just shut off the lights in the room. It won't make him completely immobile, but it should slow him down enough to last the entire night. The issue is that you can only shut off one room light at a time. And if you shut one off, you can't exactly turn it back on unless you switch off another light. And that brings me to my next point. Remember the legless one that I mentioned last night? Well, you can't exactly look at him if the lights are off. So if he's in a room, you'll have to wait for him to move to another one or switch off another light temporarily to deal with him. Now, I know that's a lot to take in, so I'll summarize what I've said. Dipsy, the green one, moves slow in the dark. Dinky Winky, the legless one, is immune to the vision in the dark. You can only have one room dark at a time. And also, keep an ear out for Poe, the red one, and shut the door on Lala, the yellow one without a head. That should be it tonight. Uh, again, I'll update you tomorrow if there's anything new in store for you. Uh, please stay safe. Hate to see you get... Uh, yeah. Stay safe, and I'll talk to you tomorrow.
Hello? Are you still there? Oh, thank God. I'm sorry, you just can't really ever be sure. Uh, so, figured out some stuff. Past few days I've been worried that something's been up with this place. Uh, turns out I'm not crazy. There's something going on around here, and it's not good. I'm not really sure how much we can talk about it right now. Oh, uh, by the way, yesterday we found one last robot. Some blue vacuum cleaner looking thing. I don't think it'll give you any trouble. It seemed to be in pretty bad condition. If it does activate, though, be extra careful, uh, will you? There's some stuff that they used to be for, and if... Oh, shit. L look, I, I gotta go. Just keep what I said in mind, okay? Talk to you.